Good morning, guys. I love those mornings when you wake up and there's already coffee brewed. It just makes your day so much easier. Good morning, guys. But that also means that uh, you're subject to leftovers, and if there's not enough left over, such as that, <laughs> or if it's brewed wrong, then you just have to deal with it. But it's great for laziness. So let's be honest, that one little thing of coffee wasn't nearly enough, so let's, uh, let's brew some more. Perfectly brewed coffee. Made only by the coffee enthusiast. So I've just been going through uh, a couple of things and playing with color correction and stuff. So what I'm about to show you is pretty, pretty crazy. So look. That's the video before color. And click. That's the video after color. Now that looks pretty bad on the camera. But let's let's do this again. I'll show you the difference. So that's with, and this is without. Yeah, pretty crazy. So I was just graced by the uh, Aaron Manning Home Studio Lighting Kit Inclusive Instructional DVD, uh, and it was absolutely cheesy and hilarious. But I didn't really learn anything either because I already knew all the stuff that she was talking about. This is why I like being self-taught. It helps a lot. That rhymed on not purpose. Hey, family's coming up. I don't get to see them very often, so it's good. I'm glad that I'm off and they're coming at this time because I'm usually working when they come out. And maybe I'll take some professional some professional photos and video with my Aaron Manning all-inclusive home studio lighting kit. <sighs> oh man. It's just so, it's just so cheesy. The, the educational DVD. Because she said the exact same thing in every one. In like every single scene. So I don't know why she just didn't say that she could apply it to every like she could apply it to every scene. I have a frog on my head now. I'm cronin with today's weather report. <laughs> Do you guys remember that? Link of the doobly -doo. Now this might sound a little bit rude to say, but I was actually really impressed with my mom because she knew that when my brother was playing the Mario theme that it was the Mario theme. And you didn't really think that, you know, they'd be much into video games or no much about video games, but I guess growing up hearing these, or hearing these as we are growing up, like the last 25 years or so, she's gotten to know which tracks are which tracks. And I think that's awesome. I'm proud of her. I thought I'd find you in here. For some reason, cats just love boxes. This is a microwave oven, which I will show you later. So I guess uh, brother's coming up tomorrow night, not tonight, uh, which is fine, because I'll still be here tomorrow night, so I get to see him. It's all good. It's all okay. It's okay. But I swear it's like I'm a natural born, 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 born klutz. Um, the amount of times I almost fall per day. Is, is just incredible. I must be a cat though. I was laying on my feet. Slash never fall. And then again, I am, you know, part lion. I'm a Leo. I don't know if that counts for anything. Probably not. So I'm actually sitting here and I'm watching Craigslist Joe um, at the... What is that word? At the recommendation of Mika Kitty. But it was like weeks ago. And now I'm finally getting around to watching it. And it's actually really, really interesting. And it's really cool. And I'm gonna get I'm gonna keep watching it. Uh so be right back. So Craigslist Joe, amazing. Just, just great, 
seriously great documentary if you have a chance to watch it. It's on Netflix, so you always have a chance to watch it. Go watch it. Just awesome, awesome documentary. And seriously, really, really awesome. Like, go watch it, please. Now. So I guess now is a good time as any to show you the brand new microwave. It is so much bigger than the other one. And look, look on the inside. Like that is, that is all the way back there. And that is a giant microwave. You could, you can cook a turkey in that microwave. And it's an inverter, so it heats things evenly, I guess. Okay. But, um, yeah. It's a lot more awesome. It's a lot bigger. Like, look at that space. Damn, girl, look at that space. You know what I think I'm going to do? I think I'm going to put this into the regular CD player in the kitchen, and I'm going to blast some sophomore. Are you serious? Is this broken too? Uh... CD. Okay, wait. Play. Come on. Come on. Good. Okay, let's go. I was gonna say, if this is broken too, we have a problem. <laughs> we have a real problem here. Alright, just dropped up my brother, and we're relatively close to a Tim Horton, so let's go there. Let's get me a coffee. Okay, thanks. So I found out some awesome exciting news earlier and that is the fact that in like a couple of weeks, like in the end of the March, the last, the last two weeks of March, uh, my aunt and uncle are going down to Cuba and we're babysitting their dog. Uh, and I'm super excited about this because I super miss having a dog. Uh, if you guys didn't know, I had Bonnie. Bonnie was my dog and she was there since I was three years old and we had to put her down in 2008. And that sucked. That really sucked. But after that, we got a cat like a year later, not even a year later, we got a cat. And cats, it's not the same. I'm just a really big, big dog fan. I love dogs. Dogs are companions. Cats are not even loyal. But, uh, but no, um, I'm super excited to have a dog in the house. And maybe we'll even get him one day, like adopt him one day, which I'm entirely 100% he's a two we he's a two month two year old golden retriever and he's friggin beautiful you'll get to see lots of him in a couple of weeks which I'm super excited about um, I'll come home <laughs> one o'clock in the morning oh man I can't wait I'm just super excited to have a dog again in the house just like that I can interact with um, and I will be that dog's best friend, I swear. If we if we do end up adopting that dog, and even if we don't, I will be that dog's best friend in the world. Because um, I get super attached to dogs. Which is probably a bad thing, but you never know. We'll see, we'll see. I, I, I really hope we adopt him. Um, but other than that, I'm going to end this tonight. and Or end this right now, for tonight, I should say. And I will see you all tomorrow because you're awesome. I'm going to go pick up my brother from his party and then edit this and then go to bed. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. You guys are all awesome. I love you all. Good night. Yeah.